All right, we're shooting a little video today of uh, Tim Nuanis' Laskin camper mounted on his Ford F-350, and he's using a Windy Nation Rover wind turbine to uh, power the battery bank inside his camper. Now you can see Tim sitting over there in his lounge chair. He invited us up here on the central coast of California today just to check out how he mounted his uh, Rover wind turbine, and we said we'd be glad to come up and shoot a little video of it. So here's his uh, truck, RV, or the camper, the Alaskan camper, and the Rover wind turbine. It's spinning in about six to eight mile per hour wind. It's hardly any wind today. You can pan out and look at the ocean, and you can see that there's no ripples on the water, so not too much wind. He's putting out about one or two amps right now, but it's still charging the battery bank. And there's uh, Tim over there. How's the, how's the beer, Tim? Nice and cold by Windy Nation. All right, thanks for the plug. <laughs> now come over here and look at how the mount's set up. So he's using a U-bolt at the bottom, a 1.5 inch Schedule 40 pipe, and then he has another metal brace up on the top that's uh, bolted onto the metal, metal racks on top of his camper. And then the uh, Rover wind turbine is about seven feet above the uh, top of his camper. So that's his setup. He's charging uh, two 12 volt batteries and he uses that to power the fridge and the lighting and everything else inside his uh, RV. So thanks for letting us film, Tim. And we're out. <laughs>